Hello everyone, this is Mamta Mund and today we will learn and solve exercise 11b questions 1 to 12 of chapter 11. Chapter name is Understanding Elementary Shapes of Class 6 of Composite Mathematics Textbook. Let's get started and solve some questions. Today we will learn and solve exercise 11b questions 1 to 12 of chapter 11. Chapter name is understanding elementary shapes and topics are protractor and topic and types of angles. Let's solve some questions. Now question number 7 multiple choice questions. Which angle is shown by the hands of the clock in the figure? First draw the given figure of 12 o'clock. This is 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 10 o'clock. This is 10 o'clock. And this angle is, this is 10 o'clock, this is acute angle, but this angle is reflex angle. So the angle shown by the hand of the clock is a reflex angle. So option D is the correct option. Now question number 8, multiple choice question. An acute angle is formed between the hands of a clock at options are 9 o'clock, 4 o'clock, 11 o'clock, 6 o'clock. 9 o'clock. This is 12, this is 3, this is 9 and this is 6. 9 o'clock. This is 90 degree right angle. So this is false. Acute angle is less than 90 degree but more than 0 degree. And 4 o'clock is this is 4. This is obtuse angle. Obtuse angle is more than 90 degree but less than 180 degree. So 4 o'clock also not correct. This is obtuse angle. This is right angle. 9 o'clock is right angle. This is obtuse angle. 4 o'clock is obtuse angle. And now 11 o'clock. This is 10. Eleven o'clock is acute angle. Eleven o'clock. This is more than zero degree, but less than ninety degree. This is acute angle. Now six o'clock. This is one hundred eighty degree, and this is straight angle. 6 o'clock is straight angle. So 11 o'clock and straight angle is equal to 180 degree. And 11 o'clock is an acute angle. So option C is correct option. So option C. So the angle formed between the hands of a clock at so, an acute angle formed between the hands of the clock at 11 o'clock. Option C is the correct option. Now, question number 9. Multiple choice questions. In the given figure, calculate the angle A. What type of angle is it? Options are right angle, acute angle, obtuse angle and reflex angle. First, draw the given figure. 
this is a and this angle is 270 degree so the angle a is 90 degree so this is a right angle angle a is 90 degree this is right angle So in the given figure, the angle A is a right angle. Now question number 10, multiple choice questions. The angle between two opposite rays is, options are right angle, obtuse angle, acute angle, straight angle. Opposite rays. This is opposite rays. And this angle is 180 degree straight line. This is straight angle. So option D is the correct option. So the angle between two opposite rays is straight angle. Now question number 11. Which of the following is an obtuse angle? Options are 90, 92 degree, 181 degree, 195 degree and 83 degree. We know obtuse angle is more than Obtuse angle is more than 90 degree and less than 180 degree. Here 92 degree is more than 90 degree and less than 180 degree. So this is an obtuse angle and other angles are more than 180 degree and this is less than 90 degree. So option A is the correct option. Now question number 12, high, high order thinking skills question. How many times during the day do the hands of a clock form a straight angle? Straight angle is equal to 180 degree. So how many times during the day? Each time two times the hands of the clock form a straight angle. That is 12 multi, so 12 hours, so 12 multiplied by 2, 24 times. So answer is 24 times. So 24 times during the day, hands of a clock form a straight angle.
if you have not subscribed my youtube channel then please subscribe my youtube channel and if you have any doubt then please write in comment section and i will reply keep learning keep watching and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you, thank you.